folks. I'm here with another cologne review. Um, this one <clears throat> is English Leather Black uh, by Dana. Uh, this is one of my cheapy colognes. Ordered this. Uh, this is probably one of the first colognes I bought whenever I started uh, wearing cologne. Uh, probably February or January. Since then, I've got a pretty good collection. Um, I've gotten some better stuff, uh, like Versace Cologne, well, F by Ferragamo, some def different better stuff since then. But this is the uh, first uh, cologne I ever purchased. Uh, so let's go ahead and unbox it. You see on the top, English Leather Black and the Dana logo. Um... On the back, you have uh, just some stuff telling you mm, why you should wear uh, English leather black. I apologize, the video quality is not that good. I am filming this with my uh, Android uh, cell phone. Okay, just go ahead and pop the top of the box here. I've ordered some more cologne earlier today. Um, should be coming in. I might review it. So this is the actual bottle. Uh, kind of looks like the English leather bottle, but instead it's kind of a reddish looking wood, and the actual bottle is black. Some different stuff on the bottom. I don't know if I can get it to focus or not. Um, this one's kind of a lot harder to find. I mean, you can find the original English leather. Pretty much anywhere from Walmart to CVS Pharmacy. It's really not that popular of a clone. <clears throat> but, uh, if you're just looking for a budget clone, don't want to spend too much money. All in all, I paid 8 bucks with shipping for this clone. Uh, go ahead and get this one if you can find it. Um, yeah, English Leather Black by Dana. So, uh, thank you all for watching. And, uh, bear with me. Eventually, maybe my reviews will get a little more better. Uh, thank you.